Hello, my name is Rachel, and today I want to talk to uh, with you guys about a company that I recently discovered called Arts Cow. Now, the way I discovered Arts Cow was when I was at the uh, Dark Side of the Force, the convention that I just vended at uh, at the beginning of April. I bought this dress. Absolutely adorable. Love this dress. It's got this gorgeous print all over it. Such a fun little, you know, it's like a a bohemian style flowy cute dress and you know great print so when I was talking to the girl who was selling these uh, she didn't give me the company exactly but she said that she doesn't make the clothes she is an artist who makes the designs and then this company prints the clothes out for her and while the label was still in the in the dress like and it's called arts cow now I, I, I went on to Arts Cow and investigated, and you can actually get them to private label, but you have to be willing to order in bulk, obviously, and it costs quite a bit more uh, to get your own label put on it. But they have no limit on creating. So you can go onto their site, find any one of their products, put whatever you want on it from photos that you have or art that you do, you know, you design it yourself, the, the print part, the clothes are already designed. You design the print part on the clothes and they print it out for you. And there's no minimum. So you don't have to buy in bulk to resell. You can just be a single person who just wants this one idea to come to life for your personal wardrobe <laughs> and, and they will create it. So <laughs> I had that done <laughs> and I wanted to share my experience with the company so they have they have first off they have so many options and, and what I'm going to do is um, you know at the very end of the video after I sign off and everything I'm going to show you like a whole bunch of screen recording of me going through the website with you and looking at some of their stuff and also how the process works to create an item through them and <laughs> They have so many different styles to choose from. They and, and I, <laughs> what I'm about to show you is kind of funny. <laughs> but I had this dress made or printed because you know you have to choose one of the pre-made styles. But I, and this is just a cute little cap sleeve fit and flare, my favorite type of skater style dress. I also discovered I'm a size large in them, even though I'm normally an extra large. But this large fit me perfectly, so I ordered this one also in a size large, and it also fits me perfectly. This is a very stretchy thick material that was the other thing like this one is very thin and flowy this one is very thick and you know a lot of uh the the cheap clothing comes in a similar fabric to this where it almost has that swimsuit type feel but this feels thicker than a lot of those like that you get from like shein and and actually there's a a, a brand on um, Amazon called Cow Cow that does really cool designs and a very similar fabric but it's a thinner lighter fabric. I was really impressed at how thick this fabric was. Now <laughs> I'm laughing because the photo on it is sort of a inside joke. <laughs> and I'll show you guys also pictures of me in each of these dresses just so you can see them. But <laughs> so my boyfriend <laughs> We're doing this beach trip. We're leaving in just a few, a few days, although you probably won't see this until either I'm at the beach or after I've gotten back from the beach. I'm not sure when this one's going to go up. <laughs> but he goes to conventions and he sort of has this inside joke with like, he, like this is how he's able to have like 50 people to come to this beach house <laughs> because these are all like convention friends. <laughs> and he has this uh, this thing at conventions where he has this postcard, which is a picture of him in a suit looking all serious and it says do not duplicate all over it and he leaves this postcard everywhere and, <laughs> and there's actually there's been like memes online about it <laughs> and, and convention groups and stuff it's it's kind of funny <laughs> so anyway i took that postcard and i had this dress printed <laughs> and it's quite hilarious <laughs> although the average person is going to look at me wearing this dress and be like what the hell is happening but i think this is going to be a big hit at the beach next week I <laughs> this is sort of a surprise I haven't mentioned to him that I was doing this <laughs> so this is gonna be a surprise <laughs> which is why I'm not going to publish this uh, until either halfway through my week or when I got back because uh, I think he once in a while he'll watch my videos <laughs> but yeah <laughs> but anyway the whole point is 
the company. I'm talking about the company. So they make it super easy. You can design anything you want, and and they got it get it got it to me in time. I um, it took I want to say it took about three weeks, almost maybe almost four weeks to get to me. But uh, the, my only complaint was although I never got a message that it shipped. I had to log into my account to see that it was shipped and there was no tracking. There was no tracking number or anything. So I was super nervous. I didn't think I was going to get this in time. <laughs> but I did and I have it and it's awesome and I can't wait to wear it. But I just, yeah, the company was great. They, um, like if you go to their website, which of course I'll link down in uh, the description box below. And this is not sponsored in any way. They don't even know I exist. <laughs> I just wanted to talk about them because I wanted to share this with you guys because I think some of you, you know, a lot of you are artists and you might want to put your art on clothing and and like the girl at the convention you if you do vending and stuff you might want to look into doing stuff for selling you know reselling with your own art on it and stuff I think it would be really cool for something like that and uh, but it, like I said it did take almost a month to get to me it does come from China but they just made the process so simple and easy I just think it's great that they allow you to do one-offs and if you Go to their site occasionally they have sales because i actually got a 30 percent discount on just this one item so including shipping i was able to get this dress for less than 25 dollars, which is just awesome for this customized dress and i intend to do more in the future with you know things i'll actually wear more than the because i really bought this as a you know one time off joke <laughs> But I do intend to use their services again in the future for, you know, making stuff like this that I'll actually want to wear everywhere all the time. <laughs> He's going to be like, why don't you want to wear my face everywhere all the time? <laughs> but anyway, I just wanted to share the company with you guys. I just think they're so cool. It's such a cool service. I think some of you uh, might want to, to explore the, with them and, and uh, you know, you might find, um, you know, like, like I was just saying, you you might want to do it for resale if you're a, um, a vendor or, you know, and you you do art. This is a, would be a new way to showcase your art. That's, uh, I guess you can do similar things on sites like Redbubble, but I just, they had such a cool selection of clothing. That's what I really liked about this company was they, they had just so many designs that, that I think would fit for my personal aesthetic once I put the right prints on them, of course. And uh, yeah, so I was just really excited about the company. I wanted to share my experience with the company, which was great. Um, I'm just, uh, my only disappointment was there was no tracking. Uh, but, and also they didn't, that they didn't email me to let me know that it shipped. That also bothers me. Although it might have ended up in my spam maybe, but I get emails from them all the time when they're having promotions and stuff. But anyway, they do have, like I said, they do have promotions. So do pay attention to that as well. Okay, enough rambling about all of that. I just wanted to share my experience with you, tell tell you how awesome I think this company is and how much fun it is, and I can't wait to utilize them to make more fun stuff. <laughs> and and I might eventually even do the uh, creating my own designs. And I might even in the future, you know, create my own designs and and do stuff for resale at conventions because I think that's just such a cool idea. Like I bought this dress for $50 and I, I think that was a good price for this dress, but buying it directly from Arts Cal, of course, you know, again, I'm paying for her art, but if you buy it directly from Arts Cal with your own art, this would only be like $25, $30, um, and, you know, maybe a little more with shipping, but, or if you can get one of their sales, $25, $30 with shipping. <laughs> But yeah, just wanted to share all that with you guys. Uh, if you want to stay tuned after I, I sign off, I'm going to have screenshots of how the site works. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you thought about all of this down in the comments below. Have you heard of Arts Cal? Uh, is there a, a similar service out there that you've heard of and maybe utilized before? Let me know all that down in the comments below. And uh, if you did enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy the video, of course, you can give me a thumbs down and please tell me all about it in the comments below. And please subscribe to the channel. And I hope everyone is just staying happy, healthy, and safe in this incredibly crazy world we're living in. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye. They really do have so many different products though. They have swimsuits and all sorts of different types of clothing, but they also have like home goods and accessories. So there are just so many different things that you can customize through this website.
I just showed you a very small selection of even just the dresses because it would take all day to go through so many of them and I just chose one at random just to to show the process I've been playing with uh, Mid Journey, which is AI art, which is where a lot of these images are coming from. And that part I'm doing right there is you can choose the background color. So the entire dress would be in that color. So anywhere your print doesn't cover will be that background color you chose. It was moving a little slow on my phone. <laughs> I also chose to leave the the trim, like the sleeves and the collar, and I think there's a, a wrist cuffs. I chose to leave all those just the solid black ground color, or background color, which I chose black. And something to keep in mind with your patterns also is sometimes like this back of the skirt is actually in two pieces. So you gotta think about how those pieces will line up. Although I didn't really do that for this tutorial. I'm just sort of winging it, but you need to consider, I think it shows you the sew lines. If you can see the red dotted line, that would be the sew lines. So whatever's on the outside of that line wouldn't show up in your final design. And think about that when you're trying to match patterns. I guess, which I've really, I've just been kind of <laughs> just putting it in and hoping for the best, but uh, I imagine if you wanted to take more time, you could get better aligned patterns and stuff like that. But yeah, all those trim pieces, I just wanted to leave the plain black. And it did the same warning with me uh, with my original dress where it wasn't a high enough resolution, but the dress still came out great. So that's not something I'm super worried about. And this dress, I just, like I said, I just put together willy nilly, but I actually kind of like the way it came out there in the end. <laughs> but that's all there is to it. And then you can save for later or you can buy now.